Hello and welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my day ones, twos, and threes. Thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in. That means well. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you all and welcome, welcome, welcome. This video is for entertainment and educational purposes only. So everything is alleged, some is not. And the fair ag use is in my description box, y'all. So let's get to it, y'all. Let's get to it. First, I want to say happy Sunday. I hope everybody is having a wonderful day. Please stay safe and all that good stuff. Please stay aware of your surroundings and please, y'all, watch the company that you keep because it just may save your life. Okay, y'all? So, thank you to, um, I want to say really, really quick, um, thank you to um, the subscribers that's been sending me cash apps. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Everybody that's been sending me messages for to take this, take that, so you can feel better. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you all. Still feeling under the weather. Um, had a fever and everything. So I'm just trying to just work on myself right now. But I, I still want to jump on here really, really quick and let y'all know, you know, that there is some stuff a brewing in T.I. and Tiny's household. And we all saw this coming. Okay, so I had to be the first. <clears throat> Excuse me. I had to be the first one. I don't know if anybody else is posting it, but I had to jump on here and post about this. Um, Y'all remember back here when um, King got into it with um, Charleston White and all of that stuff. And do y'all remember back here when um, King was getting into it with employees at restaurants and stuff like that? And he was talking about what he'll do. He'll come back there and do this and do that. Um, and a lot of stuff that King has done in the past. T.I. and Tiny has taken up for him. No matter how disrespectful he was to others and stuff like that, they took up for him. And now, it's coming back to nip him in the butt, okay, y'all? It's coming back to him. We've been saying this for the longest. If you let a child do whatever they want and you, you, you sit back and act like they ain't doing nothing, and you, you, you take up on everything that they're doing, it's going to come back and nip you right in your own household. And this is what's going on right now. I want y'all to listen to this real quick. I want y'all to listen to T.I. and um, his son. They are going at it, okay, y'all? And they got into an altercation, to be honest with you. They got into an altercation. And he said, you can't do nothing with me. So they were, they were putting paws on each other. Him and T.I. and King. And you hear Tiny in the background um, talking about what she'll do to him and this and that to, to her son. And I want y'all to also listen to somebody in the background laughing at the whole incident. This goes to show you when you got the wrong people around your little inner circle, somebody is literally sitting back laughing at him and his mother and father going at it. And then they get into a pop session together. Okay, y'all. Um, also, I want you to listen to the message that King is putting out afterwards. And we're going to talk about this. Okay, y'all. Let's go. Okay, y'all. So they had a little tussle with Paul session. 
him and his son. And like I told you, if you let a kid disrespect other adults, nine times out of ten, that child is going to grow up and disrespect you too. If you let a child just wild out and do whatever he he wants to do to other people, talk to people any kind of way, and this and that and that and this, it's going to come back to you tenfold. It always does. And it doesn't matter if it's vice versa or what. If you bring up a child and not bring up a child for, if you are in the wrong, if I do something wrong or something happens and my son know the whole incident, if I'm in the wrong, my son going to say, mama, you, y'all both need to, you know what I'm saying? Y'all both need to talk this out. This ain't no one way or the other because you was wrong too. This is how my son was brought up. And this is how I, this is how I am with him. If he do something wrong to somebody, I'm going to tell him he did something wrong to somebody. I'm not going to take up for him, even though I know he's wrong. And when you're in a household that does that, it backfires. It seriously backfires. And it is what it is. You cannot let a child do certain things and, 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 and sit back and act like, oh, he it is not his fault, blah, 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 blah. They have went at other adults over King. And I want y'all to listen to this message that King just put out right here. I want to see what y'all get from this. <clears throat> I want, excuse me. I want to see what y'all get from this. So King posted up, I don't give a F who you are. MF can't play with me in my face. Not going for that. For that, I'm a grown, a seeker man. Now, this is what he said, okay? Um, he also said, if I'm a mistake, say that. Stop making the world think you F with me when you don't. Um, did King's parents say he was a mistake or something? Oh, I mean, he did. They did say that you're, you're embarrassing the family and this and that and that and this. And he said, stop making people think you mess with me when you don't. So is all of their whole family stuff is a front, y'all? I'm just saying. Because when he does things, you know, in the past, he has done things they have taken up for him. Even though he was wrong and he should have stayed in a child's place. They have taken up for him. So why he, why would he say, stop making a world think that you F with me when you really don't, if you think I'm a, a, a mess up, okay? Or a mistake. Y'all, this family is so toxic right here. And I believe there's more bones going to come out of their closet too. Okay, he has another daughter that, you know, does stuff that you see in movies. Okay, y'all, I've, I've never known anybody personal in my personal life I'm, and out of all of my years here of somebody, you know, I've seen it in movies of people take, you know, what you, 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 you cut a cake with and cut on yourself. I've never seen this in person, I've, you know, or knew of anybody that done things like this, but I've seen it in movies. But this is going on in T.I.'s household. His daughter does this. She's very depressed and she's beautiful. And she's so depressed and all kind of stuff going on with her. And I think that um, a lot of stuff that T.I. and Tiny has done in the industry. And I think it's more stuff going to come out on them as well, to be honest with y'all. I think it's going to be a lot of stuff come out on T.I. and Tiny. They've tried in the past to pull out stuff on them. And they end up, you know, dropping a case or stuff like that. But... We've heard about their little entanglements, too, in the industry. And I think a lot of that plays a part in their children's life right now. Okay, y'all? I think that the kids know of they, they, the stuff that they were into and all of this stuff. is It's a lot going on with this family as well. Okay, y'all? I don't know if anybody going to ever bring any lawsuits and win on them. Because I think that they're very good at, you know, controlling the uh the room when they do they little entanglements and all of the stuff to make sure that people don't have no you know no evidence on them and stuff like that i think that they good at trying to cover their backs with a lot of things but the, this is another group of people that's very toxic y'all and my day ones twos and threes up here we saw this coming a mile away we saw this coming you sit up, I don't care how toxic Charleston White is and this and that and that and this. It's still in all, this, whatever was going on between him and the mom, mama, daddy, whatever it is, 
when King jumped in there and was all of this other stuff and him and King started going at it and then everybody started taking sides and this and that and that and this, it wasn't the fact that King was right about defending his parents or whatever, 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 whatever. It's the point of the principle, okay? You know, sometimes kids need to stay in a place and it is what it is, y'all. King has been so wild. And word on the street is King is out here doing street pharmacy stuff, y'all. That's what I heard. I heard that King is hooked on street pharmacy stuff. I don't know. I don't be with him. But this is the rumors that's going around. That this is why he is spiraling out of control. Okay. And he has low self-esteem. A lot of stuff going on with him. Because a lot of people be, you know, looking at him saying, you surely is, you know, the color purple stuff. Okay, y'all. So a lot of people look at him in that way. And he is beefing with people online about how he looks. All kind of stuff is going on with King. So, you know, it's not a surprise to me that the rumors that he's doing street pharmacy stuff. Now, I don't know if it's some serious street pharmacy stuff or it's just some trees or whatever it is. Too much of anything is still bad. Even trees is horrible if you if you wake up to it and go to sleep to it every day. It's horrible. Like I, you know, I'm just saying I go in the backyard and mess with them trees sometimes, too. But it's occasionally, it's not an everyday, all day thing. You know, I have known of people that, you know, their birthday, they line them up. Just line it up on the table and go until they pass out. This is their idea of a birthday. So I'm just saying, y'all, um, it is what it is. Too much of anything is bad for you. Now, working on the street is more than that. So is this why King is spiraling out of control? But it's been happening for a very long time, y'all. Him and his mama, daddy, all of them is in a serious altercation today. And he lets he lets a little cat out the bag that, oh, if I'm a mistake, then why y'all pretending like y'all effing with me and da 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 So have they said this to him, that he's a mistake? I mean, if you're saying you're an embarrassment to the family, I mean, that's somewhat what you're saying, but at the same time. Is it more to it than what meets the eye, y'all, and what we're seeing in the background? But anyway, I just want to jump on here and let y'all know that him and King just had a little wang dang doodle. Okay, y'all? Anyway, um... I got a couple more videos I'm going to put out and go back to working on myself some more because I got to feel better. You know, it's the weather's changing and this happens when the weather is changing too, y'all. Um, but anyway, um, let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Is T.I. and Tiny getting back what they, they put out there? You protect the child and it, it's no different, y'all. It's no different than... These kids that's out here robbing people and running around robbing people and this and that and that and this. There's a story that just came out in Chicago not too long ago. I think it came out yesterday or today, something like that. But two 14-year-olds just got taken out in the alley. And word on the street is, I don't know the full story. You know, it's a developing story. But they're saying that these two 14-year-olds was out robbing people. Word on the street. And every time somebody's kids is out there doing some stuff, they the first one say, oh, they did this to my baby. They took my baby. But never mind what your baby is out there doing to other people. You can't run around here, you know, um, swinging in, in, in weapons in people's faces and taking their stuff and not eventually run up on somebody that's going to, you know, defend their property and say you're not taking mine. Okay. And this is the outcome of when you have a child out here and you protecting them when they're doing wrong. And then later on, something else happens. And I just, I see this the same thing. King ain't out robbing nobody and stuff because his family got wealth. But he disrespectful is all H to the E-L-L. -L. He is so disrespectful. He can't even go into a restaurant without put, show, you know, throwing his weight around that, you know, do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? And cussing people out and you ain't moving fast enough and you ain't this and you ain't that. So, you know, people that's out here working regular jobs. He think he's so much better than everybody else. And every time he do something, mom and daddy is out here defending him. Now they're trying to defend themselves from him. Y'all heard that. T.I. had to wrestle up with him. Had to, had to do that pause session with him. Okay, y'all? This is what 
the outcome is when you have a child out here wilding out and you're not saying anything or doing anything about it. Now, I know, I know he's grown now and it's not a lot they can do. But how you raise a child is very important, y'all. It's very important. But anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think about this post session in the comment section, y'all. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.